needs versus wants that my wife and I had to work our way through. And in the process of figuring out what was a need versus what was a want, we had a lot of discussion. And the hill that I decided that I was going to die on was irrigation for the lawn. In doing so, we allowed the builder to put in our irrigation for us. They had their own company that came out and they did a fairly good job. Um, they used the Rainbird system, which is actually a really good um, controller. And we um, got a lot of use out of it over the last three years. But recently I decided to change out our sprinkler control system for that guy right there, which is a Ratio 3 controller. The thing I love about this Ratio is that it's automated, it ties into Alexa, and it allows me to do everything off of an app on my phone. Um, the other thing I like about it is that it doesn't use that guy right there, which is a rain sensor uh, that uh, Rainbird put in. It's a mechanical rain system for Rainbird, and what Ratio does it's different is that they use weather stations that are local and take the data off of there and that helps to decide whether or not they are going to uh, allow your system to run. Now you can bypass it and you can tell it you know I want to do it myself and all that but the, if you're going to be automated then be automated and uh, trust the system. So far it's worked really well for me. I've had it in for a couple weeks. Um, I also had my buddy Larry do an install for me and the reason why was because I recently had Achilles surgery and in the process of having that Achilles surgery uh, I was on a scooter and I couldn't get the scooter quite close enough to the wall to get it all installed. Larry was great, came over, did a wonderful job and I really appreciate that. So uh, let's take a look at the actual enclosure and the system itself. Uh, that's in the box. The first thing you're going to notice with the Ratio is this enclosure. This is a weatherproof enclosure that I had to purchase separately. The Ratio is actually intended to be an indoor product. Unfortunately, when I built this house and had the builder install this, I didn't have a say in where they put it. I would have preferred to have it inside of the garage, but they decided this was a better place. So when I had this installed, I basically took all of the existing tubing where all the zones are coming in and the power cord that's right here and reused it. So when you open it, one thing you'll notice here is that you can lock the box, which is really nice. Once you open it, this is pretty much the entire system. Now, I really like um, the simplicity of everything. I, I unfortunately have to use a, a stick to open this thing up, which is um, because my fingers are a little bit too big for it. But, once you get it open, um, if you take a look right there, there are two little magnets. That's basically what holds everything together. And like I said, it's just a really nice, simple system. Um, these are all my zones that were already pre-wired. I was able to just put them in. They've got these little locking gates. Um, there's also a place here for a master valve. And uh, I don't have one, unfortunately. But if you do have one, it's really nice to have for a leak detection. So if for some reason um, you'd have a, a sudden um, amount of, uh, of a pressure release, it would detect that as a leak and it would basically shut off the entire system. Um, that common wire right there, that's just a simple wire that uh, is, is common to all uh, controllers. But like I said, that's it. That's the entire system. Um, put it back together, it's just a little magnet, close it up and you're done. The next thing I want to show you is the app. When you first start up the app, it goes through a quick startup. It'll update the device if it needs to be. And uh, the interface is really intuitive. First thing is it shows us the weather for the next few days. It goes through for a couple weeks and shows when it's coming up. The dots right there are scheduled waterings that, it's, uh, that you've put into the system already. Um, it allows you, this one shows you that the next watering is going to be on Wednesday. Um, September 9th and when it's going to be going off and then I can also skip it right there uh, The next part of this is shows how um, much uh, Usage I've had through September so far today was uh, I ran it a couple times a couple minutes this morning and um, 
And then it also shows how many times so far this month that the weather intelligence has decided to skip based off of rainfall that it picks up from the weather stations in the area. And then, of course, shows you all of the different um, actual versus scheduled um, watering uh, for, for this month so far. Uh, from here, we can actually do a quick run. And these are all the different zones. Um, the, the model that I have is an eight zone system. I only have six zones in my yard, but there's also a 16 zone system that you can purchase. Uh, if I wanna run through a watering, I basically would pick the zone. The other nice thing real quick about this is that each one of these zones are actual pictures. I didn't take, these are not my lawn. I haven't gone through and taken pictures of my lawn. But let's say you have a 16 zone system and you have 16 zones and you wanna be able to um, remember like which one was that, you can actually take a picture of that area and then plug it into here and it works out great. So in this case, I'm gonna do a quick run through zone number two. We're going to hit next and then I can pick how many minutes and basically when I run it, it just starts up. And uh, from here, it gives you a notification of how long it's gonna run. You can pause it for a few minutes. If I wanted to, I can actually pause and say I wanna wait for 15 minutes, 30 minutes, whatever. Um, um, and in this case, we'll just stop it for now. Hope you guys enjoy the little review of my ratio and uh if you guys have any questions and uh, feel free to reach out to me i'd be happy to talk to you about it and uh, give you any advice that may be needed uh sun finally came out we can enjoy the rest of our day have a good one see you